Hello world, Kodak here from Eric Sins and today I will demonstrate you new features we added to our sequential switch module. For the first patch I am using sequential switch together with its CV expander module, which turns it into a fun to use 8 step sequencer. As we saw I am using black wire shape, for the filter I am using do it yourself polybox, and for envelope generation I am using our dual envelope generator. First envelope is sent to VCA and second is opening the filter. We added two new play modes, which can be accessed by pressing and holding down manual reset button and step buttons. By pressing step 2 you get into reverse play mode. By pressing step 3 you get into ping pong mode. And of course all other functions like step skipping, pausing and merging are still present in all play modes. By pressing and holding manual step button you can access the manual play mode. And by pressing manual reset button you enter clocked manual play mode. To enter random play mode, press and hold manual reset button at step number 4. For this patch, I'm using sequential switch the opposite way. Because all inputs are also outputs and they work depending on how you patch them. I have patched the clock signal from black VC clock not only into clock input but also into main in out. So now it will sequentially route the clock trigger to all 8 outputs and will trigger 8 different sounds in the system. So now it works as a trigger sequencer with all the sequential switch features. Play modes, step skipping, step pausing and step merge. And for the last patch I will use both switches together. One for the baseline and second for the drums. Also both of them are driven by the black VC clocks shuffled clock out.